Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are discussing the current transformer. The mainly use of current transformer, measuring purpose and as well as protection purpose. Now we are discussing one by one uh, how it will be used in uh, measuring areas, how it will be used in protection areas. Now we will discussing. First, if you go for CT, this is called a CT. This is called a CT. In this CT, have this is also CT. And this is also CT. The uh, the fader is passing in these areas. This is the current is passing. In this have second side, our two terminals is there S1 and S2. This is the primary side. This is the primary side. This is the second side. This is the CT. This is the CT means current transformer. In this CT, this is the primary side. This is the second side. Second side is the S1, S2. Two terminals is available. Here also, this is the primary side. This is the second side CT. This is the primary side CT. This is the second side CT. This is the second side CT. Basically, suppose this is the CT ratio is 100 by 5 amps. This CT ratio 100 by 5 amps means the primary side 100 amps is passing. The secondary side it will be shows 5 amps. The secondary side it will be shows in 5 amps. This is the CT ratio. This is the CT ratio. 100 by 5 means I1 by I2. This is the I1. This is the I2 means primary side is the 100 amps. Secondary side is the 5 amps. Suppose this is the 100 amps is passing in primary side. It will be source in secondary side is only 5 amps. Is, only 5 amps is passing. The transformation ratio. The transformation ratio K is equal to. The transformation, the transformation ratio K is equal to. I1 by I2. I1 is how much? 100 amps. I2 is how much? 5 amps. 20 is the transformation ratio. The transformation ratio K is equal to I1 by I2 is equal to V2 by V1 is equal to N2 by N1. N2 by N1. Means the primary side current is more. Secondary side current is less same way number of turns and voltage quite reverse number of turns and voltage is more in secondary side less in primary side just quite reverse secondary side is the more number of turns secondary side is the more number of turns secondary side is the more voltage compared to primary side primary side is the more current less primary side is the current point of view primary side is the more current secondary side is the less current but voltage and number of terms point of view primary side is less secondary side is more number of terms and more number of voltage that is the reason uh, ct never open in second side ct never open in second side because of this second side is the high voltage is available high voltage is available that is the reason we cannot open ct in sec we cannot open the ct secondary CTs you are using energy meters. Now we will discuss them. These are the three feeders. These are the three feeders. These are the three feeders. R, Y, B, N. These are the three feeders. In these three feeders, you have the three CTs. These are the three CTs. These are the three CTs. This is the energy meter. This is the energy meter. In this energy meter, A1, A2, A3. A1 means CT1. A2 means CT2. A3 means CT. Every CT have two terminals. S1, S2. S1, S2. S1, S2. This 
this is the CT1. This is the A1. This is called as A1. This is called A2. This is called A3. In this A1 have two terminals. In this A1 have two terminals. Every CT have two terminals. Every CT have two terminals. This is the S1. This is the S2. This is the S1. This is the S2. This is the S1. This is the S2. This S1 is connected into this S1. A1 S1 is connected into this S1. Next A2 S1 is connected into this A2 S1. This A3 S1 is connected into this A3 S1. Remaining S2s. Remaining all S2s. Remaining all S2s will be common. A1, A2, A3, S2s are common to all each other. Next, this, this is the energy meter. This is the energy meter. In this energy meter, here have V1, V2, V3 and neutral. Here also line and neutral. Here also line and neutral. Uh, here RS485 RS port also is available. And one more is the Two terminals is there, terminal uh, one, DZ measuring purpose and EV measuring purpose, two ports is there. This is the port one, this is the port two, two ports is available inside and meter. This power supply also, same. This is the V1. This neutral is connected into this neutral. Same, take the power supply in single, one phase and one neutral. Take the one phase and one neutral. This is the neutral. Take the phase. Take the any phase. Take the any phase. Here are uh, two ports is available. This is the port one. This is the port two. These two ports uh, mainly you are using for the this energy meter. We are measuring uh, normal EV and DZ purpose. One port we are using in normal EV measuring purpose and one more port is there we are using for the DZ running. When EV failure, DZ is running. That time separate uh, DZ energy also it was measuring. RS485 port mainly we are using for the uh, monitoring. Uh, this energy reading, this energy reading we monitor. This energy reading, we, we this reading we, we will monitor it system that purpose we are using rs485 port for example this is the ct this ct ratio is the 100 by 5 amps in this ct ratio is the 100 by 5 amps 100 by 5 amps this energy meter this ct value will inserted in this energy meter primary side p1 second side p2 these two value he will inserted in this energy meter suppose in this fader, suppose in this fader, 80 amps is passing. Suppose in this fader, 80 amps, suppose in this fader, 50 amps is passing. 50 amps is passing. In this 50 amps, primary side is the 50 amps. In this 50 amps, secondary side how much? 2.5 amps. Secondary side how much is going? 2.5 amps is going. This 2.5 amps is entered into this energy meter. This energy meter already we are enter the CT primary and secondary. Multiplication factor K is equal to 20. Multiplication factor K is equal to, sorry, transformation ratio K is equal to 20. This 2.5, you will multiply and we will measure the energy. PT value, PT value already by default, 415 volts is coming in this energy meter. Already we are giving the amps. This amps, multi, uh, transformation ratio, multiplication, multiplied and voltage is available, current is available to measure the, to calculate the power and as well as to calculate the energy and record in this energy meter. Record and it will show the energy. Mainly you are using uh, the CDs in this energy meter areas, measuring areas, measuring areas we are using in this is CDs. CDs is mainly sensing the current, sensing the current and pass to the energy meter. This energy meter was calculating power and energy was calculating and it was displaying. And uh, three important points is available. One is the, this is the actual, uh, this is the conductor. 
this is the conductor current is passing this is the ct the ct direction is the this the ct direction is the this you will uh, the ct was connected in reverse direction it will be measure the wrong reading it will sense the wrong reading the wrong is wrong reading is sent uh, pass through this energy meter this energy meter was calculated in wrong the ct this is the current is passing clockwise direction only you will uh, install the ct then only uh, then only uh, sensing the correct values second one any terminal was interchanging any terminal was changing the wrong reading was measuring any terminal was interchanging the wrong reading was measuring third one every one year compulsory calibration is required every one year compulsory calibration is required otherwise it will measure wrong reading otherwise it will measure wrong reading the current transformer we are using in protection areas this is the fader sorry this is the fader in this fader have one circuit breaker is there in this fader have one circuit breaker is there here the this is the ct this is the ct this is the circuit breaker this is the circuit breaker this is the current transformer this is the current transformer this is the current transformer this is the trips trip circuit this is the trip circuit this is the plug this is the plugger this is the plugger this is the solenoid this is the solenoid this is the battery voltage the battery voltage this is the battery voltage this is the trip circuit this is the trip circuit suppose for example in this breaker is the suppose in this breaker is the 100 amps in this break sorry 1000 amps in this acp breaker suppose in this any breaker for example in this breaker is the 1000 amps capacity breaker rating is there the ct value is the 1000 by 5 amps the ct ratio is the 1000 by 5 amps suppose here a circuit breaker they are setting a safety point of view 80 percentage of up to 80 percentage of load only allowing in this breaker exceed this 80 percentage load the breaker was tripping the breaker was tripping for example the breaker was tripping for example 80 percent means 800 amps up to 800 amps it was allowing it was allowing if you go for the example in this fader now in this fader now 500 amps is going in this fader now 500 amps is passing this fader 500 amps is passing 500 amps is passing 500 amps is basically 500 amps is passing here primary side is how much 500 amps is passing in primary side ct secondary how much is going 2.5 amps is going ct secondary is how much 2.5 is going how we can calculate transformation ratio k is equal to 1000 by 5 200 transformer ratio ratio is the 200 transformation ratio is the 200 transformation ratio k is equal to i1 by i2 i1 is how much 500 amps is passing i2 you don't know but transformation ratio is how much 200 transformation ratio is how much 200 now we can calculate i2 is equal to 500 by 200 this two this two 2.5 amps is coming 
how much amps is going? 2.5 amps is passing CT secondary. This 2.5 amps corresponding flux was generated in this area. This solenoid wall cannot pull cannot pull down. Why? Because uh, there is uh, there is no that much of energy. It's not it's not possible to pull down. Why? Because that much of energy is not available. That much of energy is not available. That's why we cannot pull down this plan this plunger. We cannot pull down. Why? Because here we we are here uh, there is, uh, here uh, that much of energy not uh, producing. That is the reason we cannot pull down. Now if you go thousand amps is passing. Now thousand amps is thousand amps is passing in this feeder. Thousand amps is passing means second side how much is second side how much amps is coming? Five amps is coming. This five amps flux was generated those flux those flux pull down those flux is enough to pull down this plunger the circuit was closing the circuit was closing the circuit was closing means hardly here a uh, dc supply is there the dc supply the circuit was closing obviously current is flowing this current flux was generated because of this current flux was generated in this in this coil, this coil what is doing? Full this, this coil is full. This breaker, this coil is full. This breaker, the breaker was isolated. The breaker was isolated. Why? Because thousand amps is going already in this uh, ACB breaker. Already in this breaker, already we set up to eighty percent amps. Up to eighty percent amps only you are setting. Exceed that. Exceed that. The relay it was tripping. The relay it was tripping. Here mainly CTs. Here mainly CTs we are using sensing purpose. It was sensing how much amps is passing in this feeder. The information is passing to the trip circuit. The information is passing to the trip circuit. The trip circuit was tripping. In this solenoid one, they are manufacturing time. They are manufacturing time up to four amps. Up to four amps, the flux is not enough to pull to pull this plunger down. Exceed this four amps. Exceed this four amps or exceed this five amps. It's enough energy to pull down this plunger. To pull down this plunger means the circuit was closing. The circuit was closing. The current is passing. Flux was generated. This flux is full this uh, moving contactor this flux was pulling this moving contactor the circuit breaker is isolated this is only for the uh, understanding purpose basically in a real time mainly uh, high level breakers just a command it will give uh, in this breaker have closing coil tripping coil shunt coil only three coils is available just uh, pass the information nc and o nc and o information is passing the coils was tripping the calls was tripping. Thank you for watching my videos. Please subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you.